Welcome to our HTML tutorial series. Today we will teach you how to create a login form like this. So in the login form we have username and the password field. So let's see how we can create a HTML page and then add a login fields here. So we have username, password, reset button and then login button. So every HTML page starts with the HTML tag and ends with the slash HTML tag and after that we have head tag. In the head we usually write the metadata like title, login page. So if we run this, this title will be displayed here, login page. So after this, the body tag starts and here we have to close, close the body tag. Under body we have the table. So we are using the table to align the different fields. So one side we are aligning. Uh, username password and another side we are aligning the text fields so first is the on the tr we have td tag call span 2 and the html login page so this is the title which is displayed here so on the uh, first td is password so this is password tag, password and first is username and this is the username and the after that the text field input type text and the name of this text field is user id. So this is displayed here. Then next tr is to display the password. Password. So this is password which is displayed here. Then we have uh, input type password. So input type password is a field text field. When you type in anything data any data here, it won't display the data. It will just display the star star star. So this is the use of input type text. Then we have the another TR and here we have reset button. So this is the reset button and the submit button. So submit button is uh, actually submits the form to the server. We can write any name here. Login form then method so method is usually post and post method actually sends the data to the server as a post request and action is let's say login.php so our data will be posted to the login.php for validation and on the click of button we are calling the check this dot form javascript so this is actually for validating the user input if i click here it is saying error error in password or username we need to return true or return false so now form form is not submitted so it, uh, if form dot user id dot value is equal to this rose india and password is also rose india it is saying that the
that now that we are returning true is form will be submitted and if the user and password is not rose india rose india it will display error message so let's enter something else here error in, error in username or password now i'll write enter this rose india rose india and login so it is form is submitted so we don't have any server side script so it is saying file not found so in the next sessions we will use this form to validate the user against the database using php so in this tutorial we learned how to write the login page then write the function to validate the field and then submit it to the server on our website you can find hundreds of tutorials on html and you can learn from these html tutorials thanks for watching the video and subscribe our channel